Jones. Real deal, real deal, real deal. Word. That was shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. What's the Mr. deal? Robert Daniels himself, the, 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 the man who got us started. Congratulations, brother. Thank you, man. The man that got us started, man. I just got to look at you. Just you look good. You look young. You look still. You see me, right? You look good, baby. Come on, Thank nigga. Look. Come on, man. This is my wall. This is my uh, wall, Ray. This is my wall, Ray. Come yeah, on. Nigga. <laughs> That's the first trophy. Yeah. That's beautiful. Ah, yo, listen, Ralph, man. Oh, man. The history that we got. The history that we had before I even knew you. Word it's up. Like, let me just let me just explain this to you, right? I'm a young dude that's maybe 10 or 11 years old. You know, at that time, my mother had, you know, more kids. And I would just have to babysit a lot, right? <laughs> She'd make me babysit them because she had to work and, you know, she was still young. So you know how that go. Yo, you babysit. You was at that age, and um, all I did was listen, look, look at video music box every day, constantly, like, make my toast. You know, toast is my shit. I, I can eat a piece of bread and butter and put it in a, you know, toast. Damn so I'm sitting in front of it, eating toast and shit, drinking water and shit, sugar water, toast. And I will always say to myself, I wish I could be on video music box one day. <laughs> I wish I could be on it. And when I met you, it was like, it was that uncle feeling that you gave me. It was like, you was so real that, I guess I guess that's why we reflect the way we reflect with each other, because our hearts. Yes, sir. You got a big heart, Ralph, and you always gave shots to niggas. You always did that. Yeah, man. Thank you. Thank you for giving us a shot, man. And yeah. You know, you know, just Wu-Tang, I speak for the crew. Yes, so, sir. Thank you for giving us the shot, and thank you for inspiring a culture that nobody thought would be as big as it is, Ralph. Yeah, you nobody, nobody. You seen something in this shit, yeah. and you just exploded it, and now this shit is a fucking trillion dollar, a trillion dollar investment, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank Yo, you. man, look, thank you, man, because, you know, y'all just gave me the energy, man. When, even when I was directing them videos for y'all, you know, I, I couldn't do it without the energy that you gave me, man. <laughs> you see, I was always attached, right? I've always been attached. I always <laughs> wanted to be next to next to the, you know, the situation, man. Yo, yeah. listen, you you had your hands in some dynamite shit on the Purple Tape album. Yes, you sir. You was responsible for the video, Incarcerated Scarfaces. You was responsible for Heaven the hell? video Ice Cream. Yeah. Which and was both those two records with smashes. Yeah. And, um, I remember us being in Harlem and shit. Where was that? Wagner, yeah. right? Yeah, he was in Wagner. We was in Wagner. Was in Robert yeah. Wagner. Robert, yeah. Robert Wagner Projects. And yeah. you know, for us, you know, for us, it's hard for us to go to another nigga project and think we safe, but we trusted you. Yeah, yo, we you know, I tell, you. I tell people, you know, before I did your project, I did the, 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 the cream joint, you know? Yeah. And I wanted to take your... Yeah, I wanted to take y'all outside of Staten Island so that Harlem niggas could see that y'all were some real live niggas. <laughs> right. Oh, so you had a plan. That was Yeah. Plan. Remember, okay. we, we shot that right by Willieburg. I wanted Harlem niggas to see y'all niggas. Is we right here by your spot, nigga. Willie. <laughs> Willie's was the shit. Willieburg is. But look, you said something key, right? You said something key. You spoke on cream. Yeah. Now, I want the world to know that Ralph was the one that did the video for the record cream. Back then, that was a time where if you had a producer or you had anybody that was successful in the music business kind of your neighborhood, you was the shit. Mm. And when you came out there, it was like you was like a rock star. You was like... You was like motherfucking Donny Hathaway out there, like <laughs> you know. <laughs> I'm keeping it a hundred, like you know, kids and everything was was on you. And around that time, it was a lot of hustling going on. Niggas was hustling right on the spot. <laughs> and it's like I always wanted to show you. I always wanted to show you. I was so excited to show you that show niggas is sat now and got money. 
Like, yeah. yo, niggas out here got money, man. I'ma show you, I'ma show you the money niggas. And those was my niggas. And and you know, they was from different parts of of of, of, of the states. They was in different states, but Crane was the shit that really woke up all real niggas to saying, yo, we the same niggas, we could get money too. That's right. Cash rule, nigga. And That's I right. remember I told you, I kept telling you, yo, make sure the MVBs is in there. Yeah. <laughs> so you was like, yo, you took us right to those spots. Willie Burger. I remember <laughs> Willie Burger's Harlem. That's why I said a lot of places have a lot of, of historical moments for us in the time yeah. that we made that album because we was going to those places. Jamaica Avenue. You yeah. took us over there to Jamaica Avenue. To the Coliseum. The, the Coliseum. So... We was just we was just following the yellow brick road, man, and you was just you was just in your prime, and you said, "Yo, chef, this is the shit. I'm I'm a lace you." Yeah, we won't get up. Those two records wind up being the biggest joints on the album. Yeah, yeah. Hey, look, man. All I was doing was just painting the picture that you had already you you had already wrote out, bro, and you right. painted a damn good picture for me to to work with. <laughs> so I was like. I, I need to do that. I told Steve Rifkin, look, like, like, I got, I, I'll do the whole album if you let me do the whole album. <laughs> Shit like that, right? Nah, but yo, we was happy, man. We was happy because we requested you. You know, it wasn't like a situation where Steve went and got you. Yes, it was sir, yes, sir. That we, it was something that we really wanted to happen. It was like, yo, we want Ralph. And to this day, you still reign supreme. I'm proud of you still doing what you're doing. Of yes, course, sir. you know I'm a die. I'm a, I'm a die hard. I'm a motherfucking Always. disciple. You know what I mean? I'm a <laughs> disciple of video music boxing. What it did for the culture, and you are the um. What's my nigga name? The Soul Train, Don Cornelius. Don Cornelius. Nigga, That's... you the you the Ralph McDaniels of this shit, b. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you, brother. Visual of making niggas want to be seen, b. You yes. know. Yeah, no, nah, we can't stop. We got we we can't stop this shit. This is what we do. This is what this we was born to do. Ain't nothing gonna stop. Ain't, Ain't nothing, nothing gonna, gonna stop, stop, Ray. You you already set the blueprint. And 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 look, this shit is nigga. Like you said, it's in niggas' blood. Like like Davies and and the brother from Buffalo was saying. You know, it's it's in their blood. They can't help it. They can't help it. <laughs> you know, this is what exactly. we do. We ain't going nowhere. We ain't, we ain't going, going to damn place. <laughs> Shout out to all my OGs, man. All my OGs. That's still doing what they doing and they dancing, man. Yo, I'm proud of y'all, man. And yo, we here, man. Your nephews is always here, you heard? Salute, brother. God bless you. God bless your family, everybody. You know, I love Likewise. you. Likewise, bro. So we talk soon, brother, all right? All right, bro. Salute. Salute, King. Salute. Peace. Peace. That's my brother right there, man. My big brother. My big brother, Ralph. Been a long night, right, y'all? That's how it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be like that. I want y'all to think. I want y'all to understand that this album has so much mechanics involved with it that it inspired a nation. And it took people to a place where they probably thought that they couldn't accomplish. And um, I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a person that understands that yo you can't give up, man. You know, no matter if you in your lowest situation, still be a dreamer, man, because it can happen. And it starts from being real with yourself and knowing what you're capable of doing, because you're capable. I'm capable. You're capable. We all capable, man. Tonight was lovely, man. I had a good time. Um, shout out my nigga D in the building. It's my nigga. Flies, nigga. You and my sister. Yo, I love y'all, man. My sister, she stay driving race cars all fast. Slow down, girl. Yeah. But yo, check it. Before we slide out, right, I want to tell everybody, yo, give your brother a little congratulations because, you know, I'm, I'm involved with a great cannabis business and I invested in something real popular. Not real popular yet, but it will be super popular. It's called Hashtoria. It's my dispensary company that basically 
Oh man, this is gonna be something beautiful for y'all to check out soon. You know? Shout out the cannabis world, man. The cannabis world is serious, so I wanted to be a part of it. And you know, of course I got some beautiful partners that helped us design this situation that y'all gonna love. It's called Hashtoria, so I want y'all to follow us at Hashtoria. You know what I mean? H-A-S-H. S T O R I A Hash Story. Fuck with us, you heard? But um, I'm just having a good time, man. And um, word, right, I'm just reminiscing, reminiscing, just listening, just listening, man. But um, good looking out, man. That's all I'm gonna say, man. You know, we had a nice time tonight, and um, it's time for me to let go. Say peace and love to everybody who showed up, who got on and fucked with me. Shout out to all the fans. Salute. We talk soon. One.